Today we are going to talk about North and South, right? Yes, we are. However, it's not North Korea and South Korea, but something which was much, much, much longer time ago. There was a time called Northern and Southern States period when there were two important Korean states located on and nearby the Korean Peninsula. So. Uh, let's go and see what countries are we talking about, okay? Okay. So, come with Northern Jung-hun. and Southern Alex. Let's go. Let's go. How did the Kingdom of Pare form? Uh, well, what happened was that Baekje and Goguryeo fell to Silla. Oh. This led to the rise of Pare in the territory that Goguryeo used to occupy. Mm-hmm. Aha! So, what happened next? Uh, unified Silla and Pare coexisted for a long time. This period was known as the Northern and Southern States period. During this time, there was a renaissance in the arts and culture Mm -hmm. of both kingdoms. That must have been a very, very important period in shaping Korean identity. Indeed. Society was stable, the economy grew, and cultural exchanges took place with the outside world. It was the golden age of Shila. How did the kingdom of Pare form? Pare Wangugun, Well, what happened was that Baekje and Goguryeo fell to Silla, and this led to the rise of Pare in the territory that Goguryeo used to occupy. Um, so what happened next? Mm, unified Silla and Pare coexisted for a long time, and this period was known as the Northern and Southern mm-hmm. States period. During this time there was a renaissance in the arts and culture of both kingdoms. That must have been very important in shaping Korean identity. Indeed, society was stable, the economy grew, and culture exchange took place with the outside world. It was the golden age of Shila. 그래요. 사회는 안정되고 경제 활동이 확대되었고 외부 세계와 활발한 문화 교류가 이루어졌어요. 신라의 전성기였지요. After Koguryo and Baekje collapsed, Tang China wanted to expand into Korean Peninsula. Tang attacked, but Shilla managed to defeat the 200,000 Tang soldiers that attacked the Meso Song fortress and to destroy the Tang naval forces in the West Sea. 고구려와 백제가 무너졌을 때 당은 한반도에도 그 힘을 뻗치려 했어요. 그래서 한반도로 군대를 보냈지요. 신라는 당의 20만 대군을 매소성에서 물리쳤어요. 또한 서해, 충남 서천군 장항 기벌포에서도 당의 해군 세력을 몰아냈어요. Tang was forced to withdraw from Shilla and give up the idea of occupying the peninsula. 마침내 당은 신라에서 군대를 철수하였고 한반도를 점령할 생각을 포기했어요. In the 7th century, Shilla absorbed Baekje and Koguryeo and unified the whole peninsula. With the end of competition among the three kingdoms, society was stabilized, the economy expanded, and cultural exchange with the outside world increased. 7세기 신라는 백제와 고구려를 흡수하고 한반도를 통일했어요. 
세 나라의 경쟁이 끝나고 사회는 안정되었고 경제 활동이 확대되었으며 외부 세계와 문화 교류도 활발하게 이루어졌습니다. The Kingdom of Pare emerged from the collapsed Kingdom of Koguryo, and this period of coexistence between unified Shilla and Pare is called the Northern and Southern States period. Koguryo가 멸망하면서 Pare가 옛 Koguryo 땅에서 일어났어요. 남북국 시대는 통일 신라와 발해 두 나라가 공존하던 시대이지요. Hmm, that was some valuable time. You know, usually I don't even hear about this kingdom called Pare. How about you? Well, I learned it from school, but I think many Koreans doesn't even know it existed. Hmm. So yeah. Uh, indeed. I think we should take a bit of time to pay attention for. Those countries that are not really talked about in history as well. Mm? Yes, I agree. Okay, so see you next time, ladies and gents. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.